do have some weather moving in. I have to say, though, it's looking a little better this afternoon than it did this morning. It was very gray this morning, looking a little sunnier this afternoon. So we're getting a break uh, in the cloud cover, which is nice. We'll go, go ahead and take a live look outside. I think you can make out that while there are still quite a few clouds, it does depend where the camera is, which direction it's looking. Right now, a little bit of blue sky, but we'll call it mostly sunny. Currently 55 degrees. That's the official temp in Central Park. Most locations are in the 50s this afternoon. Costco, Connecticut, one exception. They are giving us a reading of 47 degrees. I want to point out as you move out and about this afternoon the kinds of temperatures that you'll see, right? Because we're pretty close to our high temperature right now. But at 1 o'clock, we should be at 56 degrees. Between uh, 2 and 4 will be 58 and 59 degrees. So certainly hitting that high temperature between 2 and 4 o'clock. Still, though, pretty mild at 5 p.m. What we're going to see is eventually a spring swing tomorrow. Even though we're going to see more clouds and some rain is likely throughout the day tomorrow, we still expect to hit 64 degrees as a high temperature. By Saturday, we're talking about a high temperature of only 48 degrees. It is the one dip that we have here over the next seven days. For today, this is what we have. A lot of clouds this morning, a little bit of a break in the clouds this afternoon, which is nice, especially because we do still have those mild temperatures. So overall, we'll call it partly sunny today with highs in the uh, upper 50s for New York City, some low 60s for some of our inland locations. Looks like the rain kind of fizzles out before it gets to us, even though there is rain around uh, certainly in neighboring states. The rain that we're going to see really moves in after midnight tonight. So we are watching, of course, we're watching the whole country, but we're watching one system in particular that's going to move in, giving us some rain throughout the day tomorrow. So take a look. We go through today, we get a little bit of a break in the clouds, which is nice. We'll see more of that cloud cover certainly by early tomorrow morning. This particular model showing us some rain at 5 a.m. Uh, and continuing through about 8 a.m., then another wave moving through early afternoon. So this is two 2 p.m. looking at some rain, some additional showers around 11 p.m. So you'll want to keep the umbrella handy on your Thursday. Friday's rain looks like it'll be just a little bit too far south for us, uh, but we do get the clouds on Friday. And we keep in at least a slight chance of rain on Friday. Saturday is going to be the better chance of rain. Looks like the rain starts in the morning and continues uh, off and on throughout the day. So it does look like Saturday right now looking like a bit of a washout. Sunday is going to be the better of the two weekend days. This particular model saying we could pick up half an inch of rain. Other models saying, no, we could pick up an inch and a half of rain. We, of course, will keep you posted. But we do know that you'll need to break out the umbrella starting tomorrow.